Hey, what is going on everyone? Ravi Abhaval here, founder of ScalingWithSystems.com. So one of the questions I get all the time, whether it's one of our clients inside Scaling With Systems, a friend, even a family member that's trying to run ads on Facebook for the first time is, is Ravi, how do I know what I should be running? How do I know what my ad should say? Should I use a video? Should I use an image? Should it be a stock photo? Should it be a personal photo? What's the words that I should use, AKA what's the copy on it? And the truth is the right copy uh, can make you literally millions of dollars where the wrong copy can actually cost you tens of thousands, if not hundreds of thousands of dollars. And in this video, I'm going to show you exactly how you can find and use the right copy for your business so that you can make money from the beginning. So you've been following me for a while. You might know some of these tools or you may have never heard some of this stuff before, but it's important you pay attention to this entire video because I have to give you some reasoning behind this. So a lot of people come to me and they go, Ravi, how do I know what type of ad I should be using on Facebook, right? I think everybody here, if you're watching this video, if you follow me, you follow Scaling With Systems, you probably know by now that online advertising is probably one of the most powerful, powerful things you can do inside of your company in order to generate sales and profit as soon as possible. Organic and referrals is a great way to grow a company, but if you can add in paid advertising on top of it, you can literally set on fire your company, your sales funnel, your leads, uh, and your pipeline. And that's exactly what we do inside Scaling With Systems. So this exact trend I'm gonna show you in this video is the same stuff I do for other people inside Scaling With Systems and it allows people that have never run ads before, literally never run ads, don't know anything about Facebook advertising, to set up an ad, have it converting from day one and be getting you know, $3, $5 appointments. I have one guy right now generating $3 appointments with chiropractors in order to speak with them for marketing services. And it's using the exact same method I'm talking about here. And so this will give you a great idea on what you should use inside your company and what you know is already working. So let's just dive right in the computer right here and I'll show you right now. Okay guys, so you may or may not know what this is. This is called Facebook Ads Library. It's www.facebook.com slash ad slash library, okay? And the very cool thing with this, Facebook came out with this, uh, I think a year ago um, and a year or two ago essentially. And what it allows you to do is it allows you to look at other people's advertising campaigns. and if you've been in this game long enough, you probably know that anybody that does anything great, uh, most likely they're building what's known on the shoulders of giants. So it's like, hey, someone else did something great before you, so why not take all the money that they've spent, the time, the energy, and change it a little bit to fit your own model, and then use that instead of starting from scratch. It's not copying, I'm not saying copy and paste people's stuff, but I am saying that it's a lot smarter to find something that's working from somebody else, add your own little twist on it and run it yourself because that other person, as I'm gonna show you here in a second, has already spent literally hundreds of hours, thousands of dollars, sometimes even millions of dollars proving a framework, so there's no need for you to do that. That's why exactly what I'm gonna show you here is how we are profitable from day one when we launch a campaign. So this is Facebook Ads Library. So essentially the idea behind it is that you can see the ads that other Facebook pages are running. So, you know, when there's all these like scandals with Facebook, they essentially wanted to be like, hey, I wanna show you every single ad that we're running. You guys can all see it here uh, and you can see how long they've been running it for, how much money they're spending, all that kind of stuff. And you can see the whole funnel attached to the back end of it. And so your mind's probably already working right now, but just so I can walk you through it, you can type in the name of anybody you want to right here. Uh, and you can see all the ads are running for their company. So let's just go, uh, and what you need to do is like, oh, if you're trying to run ads for your company, you need to think about, right, what's your uh, what's your market, right? So maybe your market is uh, real estate investors, or maybe your market's real estate agents. So then, you know, you could come to Google and type in real estate investors, um, you know, business, or you can type in, you gotta really wanna find out who is your, who is your main competitor? Who's the one that's spending the most money and who's the one that's dominating the market? And if you've been in the business long enough, you probably already know uh, who your main competitors are. Um, but like, let's say you type in real estate investors or real estate investor influencers, right? That's a good one. So then you can see like people like Brian Casella, um, Tom Ferry, all these people in here. And you can see that they are uh, real estate influencers and most influencers have some kind of product behind them. So let's just take Tom Ferry, for example, here. So you know, because you did a little bit of research or because, um, you, uh, uh, because you know you've been in the business long enough that Tom Ferry is a big competitor of yours. Tom Ferry's running millions of dollars worth of ads. You're not running any ads. You want to get a piece of the action. So what do we do? We come into Facebook ads, mark, uh, ads library here. We type in Tom Ferry 
Here is Tom Ferry here. It's the one that obviously has 205,000 likes on it. And boom, literally just like that, I can see every single ad that Tom Ferry is running on his profile right now. And you can literally see the ad, the ad copy, where the links go to, you can see the photos that he's using. So this is already incredibly powerful, right? I mean, you can see the different countries he's running up top, et cetera, et cetera. But the truth is, I'm gonna take you a little bit closer here and show you where most people, just like everything else I do inside this channel, make sure you like and subscribe. Where most people fall short is they just say, oh, here, you know, start running these ads. Okay, the issue with this is the ad started running on April 10th, 2020. Right now, it's April 12th, 2020. So to be honest with you, Tom Ferry doesn't know if this ad is working or not yet. There's not been enough time that has been spent for him to know if this ad's working or not. But if you come here and you scroll down and you go back to his mo long farthest back ad started running September 11th, 2019. So that is what, five months uh, ago, he started running this ad and he's still running this ad today. And he has 215,000 likes on Facebook. So he probably has a good bit of a budget behind this. So let's just say, you know, conservatively, he's spending a thousand dollars a day running an ad like this for five months. So five times 30 is 150. So he's probably spent $150,000 roughly running this exact same ad. Tom Ferry is either number one, a genius, and this ad is converting really well, or number two, he's very dumb and he just lost $150,000. Which one do you think it is, right? Obviously it's a former of those two. So then you can know that if he's running the ad for a long time, there's a good chance that it's working, right? September 11th, September 11th. And so these are things that you can start seeing I would never run an ad that just they launched today, yesterday, even the past seven days. I, I've come to profiles, because I do this as well, and I look at my competitors, where I see ads running for a year plus, and they're big guys running for a year plus, and if they're running an ad for a year plus, there's a good chance that that ad is making them money. And so all I have to do is take this similar copy, right? You can see this whole copy here, take a similar image, and then what I'll even do is open um, a link in a new tab, and I can even go inside of their back end and see what their whole funnel looks like. I can create the exact same funnel as this on something like ClickFunnels or WordPress, whatever it is. And I can just go through this whole thing and see what happens if I schedule my, uh, enter my information here or I schedule a free call. Like what does that include? And I can make my exact funnel the same as Tom Ferry. So obviously don't copy and paste. That's not what I'm telling you guys to do, but I'm telling you this. For the longest time, you know, if you wanted to, see what your competitors are doing. You had to have like a mole or a spy inside of their company. But the, the beautiful thing about online advertising, one of the million beautiful things about it is that everything is open and you can see how everything works. And so if you were able to find an ad that's been running for five months and it's connected to a funnel and you know that this person's making money because they've been running over five months, you can take that exact same ad, make it your own, that exact same funnel, make it your own. And then instead of it leading to Tom Ferry on the back end, it leads to you on the back end. And now you're the one making money. It's as simple as that. You can do it for anybody. Any, and, and the other thing as well, let's say you don't know. Let's say you service chiropractors, for example, right? So you can go in this little search bar here and type in chiropractor, chiropractor. Right? And maybe you do run ads for chiropractor. And maybe you're curious what other people are using to run ads for chiropractor. So let's say here's Roos Family Chiropractor, 1.7 thousand likes. And you know, obviously likes aren't exact like indication. Their Facebook page likes aren't an exact indication or the followers of how you know successful and how much money they spend on ads. But you know, it is a good indication, honestly. It, it is a good indication. So Dr. Josh Wagner, he's a chiropractor, 3.4 thousand likes. So here is... Uh, Okay, so actually it looks like he is running ads to chiropractors. Is that what it seems like right now? Elevate your practice to the next level. I always scroll all the way down. This one's running February 1st, 2020. So two over two months he's been running this ad right now. So if I was targeting chiro chiropractors, I'd probably watch this video and see exactly what he's saying. I'd see if I can do something similar. I'd see the copy, see if I can do something similar. And I'd create a similar funnel from that as well. Okay, so let's see if we're actually like trying to service chiropractors. We're trying to get them more patients, right? Chiropractor. Or if you guys have been following me raw, you know I am not a great speller. Okay, so here's Roots Chiropractic, um, live webinar. So you can see that right now, during, um, during the crisis where they can't help, uh, where chiropractors can't necessarily see their patients, these guys right here are running a live webinar on, a, I'm assuming, some kind of offer that they're doing as a chiropractor to patients. 
right? So they, as chiropractors, are running a webinar targeted towards patients and people that need help. So they found a way to make money right now during the crisis. This is a million dollar idea that I literally just stumbled across while I'm on here uh, because they have found a way to make money while other chiropractors aren't making money. So this chiropractor is probably gonna do this for himself. And if he's very smart and this works out really well, which I can see that he's been running this uh, for only about 10 days now. So I would probably check on this in about 10, 15 days. But um, if he's running this really well and he's smart, he'll probably start running this for other chiropractors so they know how to make money also. And if I click this little button right here, I can see what his funnel kind of looks like. So this one's an Eventbrite. So he didn't even create a funnel on the back and it's literally just an Eventbrite. Um, and I don't know if you can see a number of attendees on this. I don't think that you can, but, um, but you kind of get the idea here, guys. So very, very easy for you to type in anything that you want to type in, whether it's an industry, whether it's a specific influencer name, whether it's your main competitor, see what kind of ads are running. You can opt into their funnel, see what their emails look like, opt in their email list. There's no reason why you should be starting at scratch. There's zero reason why you can start at scratch when you could do something as simple as this and uh, you can literally just jump ahead and start working and then have everything be very, very similar to what your competitors are doing, except for at the end when they get on a call with your competitor, now they're gonna get on a call with you, okay? So that's what it is, it's called Facebook Ads Library. This is the ethical way to steal your competitor's research. Um, if you guys got a lot of value out of this, do me a quick favor, please click the like button, click subscribe down below, make sure you share it with one of your friends, um, and also comment down below if there's any other tools or any other questions you guys have about Facebook advertising or lead generation click funnels, and I'll be sure to answer it as well. And then if you guys want to get a little more personal with me, you wanna go a little bit further with me and see, um, you know, ask me a little more questions, hop on some Q and A's, uh, maybe some calls that I host live inside of my free Facebook group, Scaling with Systems. Uh, I'm gonna drop the link for it below. Uh, I please, please, I, I ask you guys to join it. It's totally free. I engage and message every single person that's inside of there. Uh, and a lot of the content pieces that I get for my YouTube channel, it comes from people that are asking questions inside of that group. So the link to that's gonna be below. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.